bows at it. Today I will be preparing some fried baked chicken. If you have not yet subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and click the bell. Thank you so much for the support. Continue to like and share my videos and you can leave a comment below. See you soon. Yes guys, so this is my chicken that I will be looking about and I will be frying my chicken and then I am going to top it off in the oven in some coconut flakes. All right, so this is my coconut flakes that I will be using. All right, and for the egg wash, I'll be using two eggs. And as you can see in the egg, I have a little cayenne pepper, oregano leaves, and some salt. All right, and this is my flour. I have some all-purpose Maggi seasoning. I have cayenne pepper, a little salt, and a little black pepper. All right, and this is quarter cup of water that I will be adding to my egg wash. You can choose to use milk, but I choose to use water and half lime. All right, stay tuned for more. Yes, guys, so my egg is whisked and my flour and seasoning is combined. So I'm going to show you my process. So this is my egg wash. And I'll be placing my chicken in my egg wash. like so just ensure that all your chicken get a little of the egg right. and then I'm going to take off the excess amount and I will be placing it in my flour like so amount place it in the flour and you're gonna ensure that all your chicken get as much flour all right so I will be back to show you my next step stay tuned yes guys so as you can see my garlic three cloves of garlic and I'll be using a piece of rosemary instead of thyme right So I'm going to place my chicken shortly as soon as this is infused a bit because I want everything, every flavor in it. I did not put any pepper inside because I use a lot of cayenne pepper and also the sauce that I'll be using is a bit spicy but you can choose to put whatever you want in it. All right, so I'm now going to place my chicken inside. All right, so I will be back. I'm giving this say around five minutes on each side. As I said, I will be topping off this inside of the oven with some coconut flakes stay tuned yes guys so after five minutes i will be turning all right so i'm going to place it on the other side wow this color is beautiful golden brown all right and after it's two minutes to the next side wow beautiful and I'm going to let these stay for the next three minutes and I will be back stay tuned yes guys I'm actually removing these now and I'm going to place them on a napkin
right i will be back to show you my next step stay tuned yes guys so i will be topping off this inside the oven with some fruit punch sauce sweet and sour sauce all right and i will be adding some coconut flakes as well and here i have some scallion and onion and scotch bonnet pepper all right so this is how i will be doing it so i'm gonna place it inside here my oven is actually preheating right now at 145 see you can top it up a little at 185 just for it to get a little more crispy i'll be leaving this inside the oven for see around 25 to 30 minutes So I'm just going to put a little of the sauce inside. Head in with my coconut flakes. I'm keeping the oven as low as possible on the low heat because the coconut flakes is easily burned. All right. part of the spring onion is for flavoring all right and I'm will be adding some onion as well some scotch bonnet Stay tuned for my next step. Yes, guys. So my fried baked chicken is ready. All right. Please remember to subscribe to my channel like my videos and you can place a comment below peace out be safe